Welcome to the next lecture of development of lateral surfaces. Up to the last lecture, we have seen the development of square pyramid and the development of prism. <coughs> now, in this lecture, we are going to see the development of pentagonal pyramid. <coughs> now, let's see the statement for pentagonal pyramid. First, a pentagonal pyramid side of base 30 mm and height 52 mm stands with its base on HP. So, here the dimensions of pentagonal pyramid is given base is 30 mm and height 52 mm and an edge of a base is parallel to the VP so one of the base edge is parallel to the VP and nearer to the it now and nearer to the it means what that edge which is parallel to the VP that edge is nearer to the VP <coughs> now it is cut by a plane perpendicular to the VP inclined at 40 degree to HP and passing through the point on axis 32 mm above the base draw the sectional top view then develop the lateral surface of a truncated pyramid <coughs> so in the statement they are given the pentagonal pyramid so the top view of pentagonal pyramid <coughs> is a pentagon and the front view of pentagonal pyramid is a triangle okay so always remember that the front view of a pyramid is triangle and front view of a prism is a rectangle now we have to choose the different positions of a pentagon that already we had seen for prism now these are the different positions of the pentagon now let's see this is the pentagon this is the rectangular face which is parallel to the vp so here these two rectangular faces which are parallel to the vp in this two diagram first and second one so and third and fourth the rectangular face is perpendicular to the VP so we have to select out of this two one now which one is the correct now in the statement they mentioned that it is nearer to it if you see the statement so they say that on edge of base is parallel to VP so edge is parallel to the VP and nearer to it nearer to it means it is nearer to the VP so if you see this diagram so in first one so this edge is parallel to the VP means the reference line and this is nearer to the VP so I can I will choose this first one I have to draw the pentagon with this orientation first one okay so draw the pentagon with the first orientation okay so here I have drawn the pentagon of a side 30 mm and the notations a b c d e now we have to find out its center as it is the pyramid we have to find its center so how to find the center now from this corner take the opposite edge and the middle point of that edge connect this corner and middle point then take any another corner now I am taking this corner C so opposite edge to that corner is A E so take the midpoint of this A E now connect this corner C and this midpoint so whatever the intersection point this is called as the middle point so mark this the point o now connect this o with all corner points oe ob oc od so these are the inclined edges of a pyramid so in case of prism there is no need to connect this center with this corner points but in case of a pyramid we have to connect this center point o with the rest of the corner so this is the top view of a given pyramid now we have to draw the front view so for drawing the front view i am taking the projection up to the reference line This is the AIP. Now mark the notations. It is one dash. This is as it is the E, so it is five dash. This is two dash. This one is what? Four dash. This is three dash. Now project all those points on the true length line.
दिस इज वन डबल डैश फाइव डबल डैश दिस इज टू डबल डैश फोर डबल डैश थ्री डबल डैश so this is the aip which will cut the pentagon now here draw the horizontal line now mark this point as a o dash now take a distance of a true length line this o has a center o dash has a center draw an arc now take a distance 3 cm in a compass as the base side is 30 mm is given so cut this arc by five parts first second third Fifth. So mark this point. A dash, B dash, C dash, D dash, E dash, and last one is again A dash. Now connect this all the points with the O dash. Okay, here I connected all these points with the O dash. Now join this base corner points with each other. A dash with B dash, B dash with C dash, C dash with D dash, D dash with E dash, E dash with again A dash. So connect those one. Okay, here I connected A dash with B dash, B dash with C dash, C dash with D dash, D dash with E dash, E dash with again A dash. Now project all those points which I have projected on the true length line correspondingly on this edges. Now this O dash to three dash. Now three dash is corresponding to the edge C. So measure O dash, three double dash. So O dash and cut C dash. Then next one is four double dash. So O dash, four double dash. Now four double dash will lies on a point D. So O dash. D dash four dash then two double dash now O two double dash now two double dash will lies on B so O B then five double dash major O dash five double dash now five double dash will lies on E five double dash is the position of five dash it is E. So cut O dash E dash. Then measure O dash one double dash by the compass. Then one da one double dash is the position of one dash. So one dash is the one dash point will cut the edge O dash E dash. So cut O dash E dash here and again O dash E dash. Here, so mark these points. Join these points. Then mark this point as one double dash, two double dash, three double dash, four double dash, five double dash, and again one double dash. So connect to one double dash with two double dash, two double dash with three dash, three dash with four dash, four dash with five dash, five dash with. One double dash. Now connect one double dash with a dash. This is the development of pentagonal pyramid. Now next we have to draw the. Sectional top view. So for drawing the sectional top view, project this one dash, two dash, three dash, four dash, five dash points up to the corresponding edges. So one dash, I'm projecting on A, 
1 dash on A then this is the 5 dash 5 dash on H E O E then next this one B then 3 dash on C then four dash with D now join these points correspondingly draw the hatching lines so this is the sectional top view thank you for watching the video